Hello, ladies, gents, and ill-tempered Haridans. Are you ready for violence? Because I sure am. Let's go into this artificer story. Get away from here, you filthy cursor. I don't need the likes of you. Am I in control? No. There is some delicious... Well, okay. There's some delicious uh, tasting of scavenger meat. The artificer explodes out of the scene. What an entrance. Meets with Bob, the robot. Hold pickup to transfer rocks or spears into explosives at the cost of food. I have an alchemistic stomach, I see. Whoop. Like the gourmand can do stuff while holding things. Well, Artificer is a little bit more focused in her power, her, her power suite. All right, let's go down this amazing pit. Wonder where we're at. What area is this? Feels kind of indux industrial complexy to me. I guess we will find out very, very soon. Don't worry about it. Question. Do explosions hurt me? I am a still alive, baby. <laughs> All right, but my spear did blow up. So if I am carrying explosives, it will get destroyed by a nearby explosion. Good to know. We're just now starting, so I'm going to learn all the intricacies of the Artificer's arsenal and all the and all the different ways of going about being a bloodthirsty monster. Man, is it nice to be able to move. And look at the, the move speed is blazing. Absolutely incredible. What a in amazing contrast with the gourmand. Not poo-pooing you, gourmand. You have your own style, not judging you. But boy, are you a sluggish tub of lard. Well, in the air, press jump and pick up together to propel yourself explosively. Okay. Does it have to be at the same time? Does it have to be maybe hold pick up and then... Yeah, hold pick... If you hold pick up and space. Only airborne. I see. Question! Is it infinite? Basically, she has an extremely... Oh, I am sparking right now. Ah, it does stun you eventually, right? I see. If I continue doing it, is there a risk of dying? She has a... Explosive biome in her stomach creates the most powerful farts you have ever seen this side of looks to the moon and it propels her forward ever so powerfully absolutely amazing that's awesome it's going to be great man uh, very smart to have this one after the gourmand is such an awesome contrast really appreciate the mobility uh, she doesn't breathe very fast. Holy crap, she explodes underwater, I see. <laughs> Good to know. Well, it seems like our karma has seen better days. She is a being consumed by violence and forever. Can I maybe skip? Skip now? Skip it? Oh, oh I, I'm actually down there. It's all good. So I think we actually want a regular spear and a grenade. Because we can make the spear explosive at any point. Oh, this spear. That's, uh, that's a spear tip. This bar rebar is a spear tip. All right. Uh, more science is required. I died way too quickly underwater. Is this simply that she has a very, very tiny amount of breath? I mean, it. Yeah, man. He, he, whoa! <laughs> and if you come even close to running out of breath, 
you're going to be ended explosively. It's like she has volatile agents inside of her person. The moment that water gets inside of her digestive tract, uh, it reacts extremely <laughs> violently. So, good to know. There is some weaknesses. There are some weaknesses to her incredible powers. So water is the enemy. I guess that's there to teach me that. You know, it's that little transition over there. It's like, hey, oh, come over here. See what happens. Explore. You know, underwater shenanigans are usually completely safe. How about you give yourself to, to this one? Oopla. Oh, oh, I can actually... <laughs> I can actually uh, traverse this. What kind of jump do you do? Jumping is for fools. How foolish. How idiotic. How low-tech of a solution to your navigational problems. Kabubo! Oh, didn't even uh, realize I could come up here. She's a little exhausted, looks like. Well, I can go up. Yoopla! Oh, that's amazing. I love it. Instant favorite character of all time. Let's go this way. Shelter, all right. Which is great, but I ain't got no food, so... Let me go and eat delicious flying squid. Whee! Woohoo! <laughs> I'm being slightly too aggressive with the usage of my explosions. How long does it take? Probably about the same as Gourmand to go back to normal. Alright, give me some food, baby. Let go of your weapons. Put down the arsenal. Yoopla. It is time to have delicious, nutritious ingestion of wonderful things. Actually, I could have eaten scavengers at the very start, right? That's what I could have done! <laughs> Actually, I shouldn't have done that because now it's just gonna get eaten by... eaten by leeches. I will like my spear bag though. There you go. Probably I'm surrounded by leeches, but it's alright. You can just fly away. Whoopla! Man, it's awesome. <laughs> Please! <laughs> well, our first encounter with a scavenger. Oh, I'm actually dead. Oh, because the other one got me. Alright, alright. Well, very, very awesome interaction with creatures. I didn't realize I can just eat this filthy scavenger and uh, it will give me food. Four. Damn. Damn. That's a lot. It does take a while to eat them. Never mind. It doesn't take a while to eat them. It, uh, it's a very, very fast interaction. Anyway, what we're going to do is grab one of these. I can... We're going to grab the grenade, and now we'll be ready to confront these filthy scavengers. I'm going on the other side of this. I'm going to end up with so much loathing in my heart for scavengers. You have no idea the level of contempt I'm going to carry in my heart for those filthy monkeys. Man, am I going to be pissed about their existence. Anyway, we are retraining things, so... Let's give ourselves a closer safe spot now that my belly is full of scavenger filth. Oh, fantastic. I'm gonna enjoy this a great deal. I can already tell. It was one of those things that you click with immediately with a gourmand. It's like, all right, this works this way. I'm down with this crafting system. It's all right. Uh, we'll make it work. Oh, yeah, let's discover things. Oh, wow, that's a, an amazing zoomy slide that he's got damn he smashes things in the head that is neat with this artificer gameplay i'm like hell yeah brother bring on the bodies we're going to rock the world these scumbags and we're going to fulfill all the promises of violence that are in my heart you and i artificer you and i are kindred spirits we are going to be together forever and it's going to be glorious the trail of violence shall never stop the blood trails will reach all the way up to the moon and back to Fat Pebbles and then all the way back to my dreams. For I shall bring violence to these monsters even in my slumber. 
and that is the narrative that we're going forward with. All right, so clearly brute force, I don't think is the way to go. Oh, I, I can't stand up there, all right. I thought for sure that you could actually traverse that. Please, I need, I need to not be leeched. You filth, leave me alone. It is a bit of a problem when they are actually off screen. Oh, they're not even here. It was just a coincidence. I thought that it was like a predetermined. I see a rock. Make it into a grenade, baby. <laughs> no, I just ate it. Never mind. <laughs> does it regurgitate as a grenade? Yes, it does. Amazing. Probably hang on to one of those. But what will be the point? I have something much better than stupid squid katas. I have explosives in my butthole. Alright, so the scavengers feels very much like a stealthy approach is the way to go. I don't see any others, so I think I have a little bit of time to get some food in my belly. Oh, this does nothing for you. I just now noticed that the nutritional value of berries is trash garbage. Also, just now realized, it's like, oh no, I can't get up there. I need to find a better path. Bitch, I am rocker propelled. <laughs> well, uh, it's time to visit violence upon your prince. Actually, I cannot reach there. So let's just go find a different path. Actually, can I go up here? Oh. So, can I throw the spear straight forward? You're dead. You're just, you're just a dead monster. You idiot! Time to eat! <laughs> ah, this is the true nutrition that I'm after. Excuse me? Try that again. Try that again, I dare you. Do it again! Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. You're gonna bump me? You got lucky, punk. You got lucky that bigger threats came around. Never mind! <laughs> <clears throat> alright, alright. Their divisor is fine. She's perfectly fine. She just uh, embraced her more base instincts, okay? She suddenly gave in to her desires to see the world burn. Here comes a grenade. Blech. I saw them. They're not gonna survive. I see a scavenger. Soon I'll see a dead scavenger. That is the... We were gonna do this! Are you dead? I believe you're dead. Oof. <laughs> okay, fantastic. And now I am the true leader of this pack. Let me swallow this thing and create uh, another grenade. Buddy, you're pissing me off. Continue coming. See what happens. Let me eat some delicious scavenger flesh. Hell yeah. Toss it into the garbage where it belongs. Ah, here's a wonderful spear. Put, put something on it. Put something on it. Maybe because I have a ridiculous... Yeah, if I have a ridiculous um, mask on, it's completely worthless. Anyway. I'm very much interested in disposing... Of this trash. Meh. There, where it belongs. Okay, I don't see a scav. I do see a scavenger. Catch, bitch! Oh, he's still alive. Not for long. Oh yeah, yeah. Po poke your head up. Poke your head. See what happens. Do it. You absolute trash. What, you, you think <laughs> you're gonna survive this encounter? He left. I brought friends. Damn it. I need more explosives. I need more weapons. What is this glowy thing? I don't need to eat this. <laughs> so you swallow another one of these, create a grenade. Loving it. I wonder, 
I wonder if I can throw down grenades like you can throw down spears. Like you do a cartwheel and let's see, do it, do a flip, one of these, and maybe you can still throw down. Let's test it. Really? I think I just threw down. Obviously, I missed my throw. <laughs> oh. Oh, he's armed. Piece of trash. Man, one spear throw can end me. You f buffoon, you have no idea how to unpluck spears, and now your brains are scattered all over the pipe. Trash. Okay, I would like, I really like to do this test. Okay, okay, jump. Yeah, you do throw down. That's awesome. All right, all right. That's going to be super major tech that I need to... I need to perfect that. Oh, okay. We know how to get there. Woohoo! What's my food intake? I'm doing all right. I see more meat. No, this is not meat. This is garbage. Just meet up there. I'm not sure if I ate it or not. No, put this trash away. I'm not interested in being a poser. What kind of time do we have? Oh, we need to return. <laughs> the fun times have, have, have been had. But it's time for me. Man, they're just infinite. They just never stop. I really don't want to die to this scumbag. Check out my incredible new tech. I missed. I missed terribly. Okay, he's leaving. Probably because it is uh, now the time for the rains to come. Woo! Oh. Don't get leeched, though. It's okay. I forgive myself. A nice tentative sortie against the filth. Scavenger filth. Yes, give myself a rock and a spear to carry on. That was perhaps, you may think, oh, there was no progress done. What the hell was this? There was all kinds of progress done. That is, count them. One, two, three, four, five filthy, dirty monkeys murdered. And a squid cut up. And it feels great. What a fantastic expedition. Sure, I stayed in place, but that's five pieces of filth no longer in Our shelter has failed. <laughs> See, I was... I looked it up to figure out whether it was a bug. And apparently it's extremely rare for shelters to fail like this. Oh, I am super hungry. But uh, here's our second failed shelter in a couple days. The rain is brutal. And then it kind of stops and then the cycle actually starts. So in fact, it just gives you a little bit of time. That's some fat leeches. What is going on down there? This leech situation is out of control. It's like they got emboldened by the rain. Wonder if the rain's gonna be hard enough for me to be stunned. That's a scavenger, isn't it? Poor bastard is getting uh, eaten. Or it may be one of the squids. <gasps> I think I just panic. I panic attacked. <laughs> oh, it's a lizard! A red lizard? Never saw one of you before. Hopefully he doesn't crawl on the walls. We're in dire need of a spear. Anyway, I'm being... Ooh. I hate this. <laughs> Thankfully, my incredible... Artificial superpowers mean that I will never be caught by filthy, dirty-ass leeches. Extremely dark, though. Hard to navigate. 
or I would have failed. Shelter? It means you cannot return to the same one. You have to make your way. You have to make your way to the next area. And I'm okay with that. Ooh. It's going to take me a little while to get the hang of these jumps and using them properly. The combination is of keys is not... It's not something that comes very naturally to me. Okay, we gotta go this way. Hopefully not get rained up too hard. So we go over to the other side. Probably there's no benefit to coming up this way. Nope. Whoopla! Probably want, even though the nutritional value is trash, probably want to get some food. Get just one pip to get an explosive. Okay, the rain seems to have calmed down and the cycle is starting. And that's how broken shelters work. Okay. What's the point of this? Why does this exist? To make it back up. I guess if you suddenly lose your incredible potency, your beans meal, it's no longer giving you gastroenteritis. This light does feel weird after Gourmand's incredible ability to slide like a champ. This puny slide is, leaves something to be desired. That is a, an area transition. Sure hope it doesn't require... It, sh it does require karma, so... <laughs> There is no way I can do this, well, unless there's a bunch of echoes that will allow me to go forward. But I don't think... I don't think this playthrough is about that. I don't think this... I think that's probably going to be 100% of our deaths. <laughs> Just scavengers throwing a spear from off screen. That is perhaps the biggest failing of Rain World. The fact that things can attack you from off screen and there's not much you can do about it because, you know, some enemies, they have ranged attacks. <laughs> there's nothing you can do to stop them from hitting you from the other side of the screen. So that's probably going to be the source of salt as we do this playthrough. Oh, wow, it just murders you instantly. All right, that's great to know. Being touched by the by the strong rain is an instant murder because the water goes straight into your digestive system. So it is, in fact, having this broken shelter is a pain in the ass because it means... Oh! Please... Because it means we kind of have to wait it out, or I will have terrible indigestion. Okay. Can it reach me? It can sort of reach me, but not really. You don't want to test me, brother. You don't want to test me. I have no idea who you're messing with. Let's remember I'm not Gourmand. I cannot just one-shot this fool. This uh, blizzard situation is pretty rough. Oh, this is bad. Let's not be foolish. Scavengers are here at the worst place possible. We can get a nice shot. Gotcha, bitch. But of course, he's surrounded by monsters. I think we're gonna have to use our nimble navigation powers to maybe dodge a couple spear shots. When the rain's coming, it does go away. Got myself another spear, bitches. What you gonna do about it? Hello. Yep. 
She was there. He tried to warn you. You poor bastard. Should have looked behind you. Okay, here comes the rain. I grab... I didn't want the spear, though. I want a body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Gotcha. That was rough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't come near. You have no idea what I'm capable of. Oh. Damn it. Your body blocked. <laughs> Time for you to meet your maker. <laughs> I don't have any more spears though. Oh, you steal yours, bitch. Ah, it was a it was a hard fought battle, but the third one of the fourth one got me. Oh man, this is this is rough. It's a rough uh, challenge to beat twenty scavengers at the same time at a in a place where it's really difficult to you know find yourself a little bit of cover and of course with the added impediment of the of the rains okay, okay let me uh rest up again i fall like an idiot uh oh it's so pissed i just need to wait a little bit are you alive? You're super dead, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, sustenance. Why is my karma so high? That's so weird. Do you see my karma, how it, it was up and then it went, was, uh, went down again? Alright, it's great to have some food in my belly. Because now I can create explosives with the amazing might of my digestive system. Make it happen, baby. Okay, I don't want these scumbags to catch me by surprise. SURPRISE! <laughs> okay, that <laughs> was largely unnecessary. The question is, where am I supposed to go? Because if if it wasn't through the door, what am I supposed to be doing? Where's the next shelter? Really could use another spear. Some kind of something I would like. Maybe I can... Nah, do you see this? The extent of her mechanics are create spears that explode. That's it. Give me another. Oh, look, another candidate to test out my ballistics. Okay, this guy's actually dangerous. Ah, oh. Okay, there's me with enough food to create a grenade. To continue the wandering of earlier. It's like, where do I go? You can't open the gate. And I've been looking at the map and it's like... Where do I go? Where do I go? There are no other paths. Maybe there's some kind of... Some kind of way to slip around the gate? We are in garbage wastes, by the way. The... When I got out of the shelter, I noticed that... It, it reads garbage wastes. Are any of these spears? I think. Yeah, yeah, that was a spear. All right. All right. Seems to me the rain's on calm down enough. Woo! Hey, would you like to die? Damn it. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. Get wrecked. Time to eat. How much do you give me? Yeah, she's definitely a carnivore. Quite the meat eater. Loves it. 
All right. I would love to know. Let's uh, explore a little bit around. Around the gate. Maybe there was a passage that I did not notice. Because I literally cannot notice any other place to go. Open! Open! I demand it! See, look at the map. Look at the map. Come this way. There, like, maybe here, but I could swear there was no path to go. The middle is a no non-starter. This just connects back down. Up? I couldn't hold on to anything. Oh, there was an exit this way. Back to the start. That would be kind of foolish. There's no way you go. You need to go back to the start. That makes no sense to me. So first I'm going to try the entrance where all the scavengers are coming out of. Maybe it's one of the scavenger treasuries that you're supposed to notice. Hey! Scavengers are coming out of here. Maybe you should investigate that because clearly that is part of your goal, isn't it? To murder this filth? Your mistake was standing still. Fool. Was that worth my spear? Not sure. Are you coming down? Are you coming down, you little bitch? He's very happy to see me. <laughs> or to get a whiff of me. Uh, the problem is, you know, the, the shelter is broken. So... I may have to go all the way back. Oh, that's a spear. That's a beautiful little spear. Let me put a frosted tip on it. I just swallowed. Why? Didn't mean to. Get wrecked! Once again, your mistake was not look, looking at everywhere that you could have looked. Please. Shut! Oh, I can't make it up there. Oh, so that's why there's a duct to get up here. Hello. Would you like to come down here? Almost got you, bitch. <laughs> You can't, you can't throw down, but you know what I can do? <laughs> throw down, bitch! I meant you can't throw up, but I can throw down. You poor bastard, you didn't know the incredible... Oh, well, didn't know the incredible artificer tech, did ya? You're not gonna get me, you filthy lizard. You're too low tech for me. Are you alive? You're not alive. You are delicious meat. Getting slightly distracted. See, how is my karma so high there? Huh. Am I supposed to grab a monkey and take it to the gate and it will fool it into thinking that I have higher karma? Because when I eat, I am happy and I let go of all my tribulations, all my anger, is that? Or is that simply a glitch of the interface? Feels like it will be a little too obscure for me to have to drag a monkey into the freaking... Into the gate. And that's what will allow me passage. You look like a fat bastard. Holy crap. Your mistake was standing still. God damn it. <laughs> I need a grenade. I need some kind of deadly weapon. I think there were some pickups up here. No? No? I don't run out of time. I feel like putting a explosive on the tip of the spear is not always the right call. Okay, so they keep going in there. It's time to follow them. I can't follow them. That sucks. Okay, well. What you want me to do, brother? I 
I use my incredible power of exploding. No, 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 no. No, I don't want to die. If I go through there, uh, there's no... There's no getting back. You'd rather go the long way back. All right, well... I think... Oh. That's my next step. Grant one of these idiots. See, my karma is high when you grant... That is, that is just crazy. I think I just figured it out. When you grab it, your karma is higher. That is silly. So, but the thing is, you can't really drag it all the way up there. You know? So you have to have a monkey. You have to kill a monkey next to the gate. So basically... I need to go back to the shelter, hope that it's not broken. But I'm pretty sure that it is. And then try again on the next cycle. As we figure out the mechanics of this slug cat, we're going to get much, much faster. Don't worry about it. It's all the learning process. Oh, hello, monkey. Oh, he has many, he has many, <laughs> many spears, but he missed with all of them. What a terrible, terrible mistake he's made. Ah, stupid screen transition got me. It was a screen transition. It wasn't the monkey. All right, we have one that may be dead. That may just be plain possum. One that's definitely alive, definitely alive. He's super dead. Watch out for the other scum lord that can come out of the hole and ruin my life. Like that. <laughs> he cut you in the head. Oh, but he threw it at angle. I was at a lower elevation. How the hell did he get me? I have a feeling that these scavengers are just getting drowned. Because I keep seeing them on the floor. I could have sworn that there was one right here, but it just got washed away by the terrible, terrible downpour. So let me go back for my weapons, and we're going to wait out the next big downpouring. Pretty trash cycle, not gonna lie. With this one out, and then we'll go to the other side. Oh, this is a little, a little too heavy, but we'll make it. Oh, yupla! No off-screen deaths, please. The screen transitions. Enemy number one <laughs> of this artificer is not really the monkeys. It's the insistence of the threats to wait behind the way that the screen changes. All right, all right. So there's the area transition. Now, I need to find myself a dirty simian to drag over there and use his retinal, retinal scan on the machine. And that's how it's gonna work out. Get up here, it's a nice hiding spot. I think that they are probably programmed to, to come this way, so I have plenty of victims. Wanna come in here? Yeah, yeah, oh, there was something. In the duct. Probably shouldn't have come in there all careless like. I really want to eat you. Just put things down. Alright, I can eat you now. Oh! Well, damn it. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. It was a great meal, totally worth it. There's plenty more where that came from. This poor bastard's gonna get a freaking grenade to the face. It's okay, I'm completely immune to them. Idiot! And they cannot throw in ducts. We have tested this pretty thoroughly with the hunter. When I investigate, well, there was some noise. You probably should investigate. I really don't want to blow you up right here. 
because you will drop and you will no longer be my retinal scan. Oh, you're one brave individual, aren't you? <laughs> anyway. It's time for me to... Time for me to... Drag your carcass. Oh, come on. Let me actually throw this. Well, that's not exactly where I wanted that to end up, but... But good enough. Is it depending on the monkey? Your karma will go up. I haven't even eaten this one. Or maybe if it's a empty body, you'll be able to do it. Eat it? Mm. What is it based on? Because the other one gave me... I think it's depending on the monkey variety. You need a high-ranking filthy simian to be able to... to get the house symbol karma. Well, it's time to visit more violence upon my foes, isn't it? Well, let's not succumb to hubris. Don't want to engage in open combat. These stealth tactics are working out pretty well for me so far. Too bad the other one left. Never mind, he's back. Oh, oh. I don't think I can reach that. Maybe from here? Yeah. Okay, buddy. I am not the stealthiest hunter in the universe. But we'll make this work. This guy is pretty potent, though. No, no, no. This shouldn't have on coming here. Are you dead? If you're not dead, you're gonna be very dead very soon. For good measure. Alright. Ah, this one gives me the weird uh, skyscraper symbol. That's, that's what it's called. Pretty sure that's the name of it. So it's like, she gets more peace of mind the higher of a threat she drags on the ground and humiliates. This is a very uh, dark-themed slot cat. This is too adult for me. We got it, baby. Hopefully they will be... Uh, I'm happy that I understood this all by myself. They didn't have to look up a solution in any capacity. Pretty nice. We could definitely eat, have a meal, though. Nice. I don't want to drag the piece of trash around anymore. Wonderful, I liked it. Like, I noticed that the karma would go up when you picked up a scavenger. You know what? You always want to go the stealthy route. I am starting to internalize that. That Go where there's pipes. Where there's, where there's shelter. And that way, this goes into the shaded citadel, doesn't it? Go where there's pipes, there's tight, cramped spaces. That way you will not get shot at from off screen. Maybe that's what the game's trying to teach me. Instead of say, uh, saying, oh, look at how unfair this is. It's actually saying, learn to play against it, scrub. All right, one more rest. Let's go. I think this is the shaded citadel. From the garbage waste, though? Is that an entrance that exists? I thought it was the industrial complex into the Shaded Citadel, but I have not encyclopedic knowledge of the freaking map, so I guess we'll just carry on forward and find out. Food bug? Egg bug, more like. Uh, there's a horrible monster. It's a horrible monster over there. Would love to have a spear. Hello. No spears anywhere. Shady Citadel. Not terribly happy with the Shady Citadel. I freaking hate this place. But it's alright. It's alright. As usual, we go to Five Pebbles. That's the objective. Cool thing about 
in the artifice there, I can just go up there. Why am I carrying this thing? We'll find plenty of food, don't worry about it. Yeah! Yeah! Where's this? Goes all the way up here, huh? Don't get on my nerves. I will blow you up, you little creature. I don't really have any kind of vendetta against you. But I am a violent individual. Don't test me. My temper is on a thin razor's edge. <laughs> All right, time to blow up some mice because I am hungry. So what happens if I do... Oh, it will probably blow up against the fruit. So let's do one of these. <laughs> ah, yes, excellent. Om nom 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 nom. Two points, that's pretty good. All right. I keep forgetting that we can just explode upwards. Whoopla! Why? Why you will grab that? Please? There you are. Does this go anywhere? Yeah. Yeah, this is, feels like the entrance into a horrible land. We don't really have a, a light. Um, is this the way to shoreline? Let's find out. Whoop. If I remember my rain world correctly, this is the way to shoreline, but of course, it really doesn't seem like the entrance to shoreline. The entrance to shoreline was different. The hell is that dark thing? It's going to attack me. I hate it. Please, a spear. My kingdom for a spear. We'll just barf out a grenade. Deterrent against these dark crawlers. Well, here's my deterrent. But uh, I missed. So now, now we have a pissed off thing that wants to fill me with poison darts. All right. Bit of a problem. I need to bring down my my blinds because I can't see jack shit on the screen. Everything's so dark. Oh, they mean to drop like a freaking stone. That is bad. Ah, now this is dark. Yeah, you, you, we can't just be coming in here. What do you even do to create some light? This is not going to work. We are in familiar grounds, though. How much food is this? Trash. Okay. Uh, she is a carnivore through and through. She will not take any other type of nourishment. All right. I mean, she will take it, but she will not be happy about it. I mean, we can always explode our way to uh, exits, but it's just not going to work out. Being in the darkness is a recipe for disaster. There's a shelter, though. I am a hungry son of a bitch, however. Oh! Okay. Did I just swallow something? Okay, Alright. We can kill one of these. Just kill one of them. Is this a straight line? It is. <laughs> I think I I killed either of them. And now it's just approaching in the darkness. All right. <laughs> hey, come with me. Uh, the war, worst case scenario, we're feeding you to a lizard. Here, have it. I mean, I am making you work for it a little bit. But don't you appreciate it? Son of a bitch, you didn't even catch it. You're an absolute buffoon. You're a trash... You're a trash hunter. 
We'll love to have a spear. That would be great. I seem to uh, dispose of them pretty quickly. A couple rocks here. I mean, let's create some grenades, I suppose. That's my my only recourse. Let's see if we can murder this lizard in the face. Get myself a little bit of food. Probably if, if they get hit in the head. Yeah, they survive. That's obnoxious. You still need to throw a rock and then blow them up. You can't just uh, blow up their heads just like that. But it's a bit of a problem. There you go. This darkness is prohibitive. I can't be dealing with it. Fool. Well, that's a scavenger. Scavengers often carry lights, not this one. Excuse me, that is my shelter. You're not allowed in my shelter? <laughs> this is my resting place. Filthy piece of trash trying to stink it up. Disgusting. Yeah. Really could use some extra meat, though. But I guess I could use a grenade to murder a squirrelite. Okay, we got one of these. Give me a, give me a rock. Yeah, there's a rock. If nothing else, we can kill one of those and eat it. But I would like to kill a lizard. I, it's right here. <laughs> Feels good to panic throw grenades. Grab me a stone. Panic throw grenades and not die from it. That is a great improvement. What happened? She doesn't eat lizards. She does eat lizards. Okay, never mind. I don't know what happened there, but... I don't know what happened there, but is this even a place where I want to rest? I suppose so. We throw the rock in there. I'm going to grab this idiot. You and I are going to be friends now. All right, stay with me, fool. It's time to sleep. We're going to carry on. I hate the shady citadel. I hate needing to carry around a light. It is a massive problem. Usually scavengers would carry them though. We just need to encounter the Dragon Slayer. We just need to encounter enough scavengers. Are you dead? <laughs> no, you're not dead. You were just asleep. Or mingling with the with the weird Bob. Bob the robot! Okay, so. There's a shelter. If I want to go to Five Pebbles, we need to make it to... It's the bottom, right? The absolute bottom of the Shaded Citadel. Then you encounter the lightning... Grenades. There's a spear right there, but you know, I am carrying the light. Kind of a problem. Well, this was a massive waste of time. Uh, so let's get started. Let's just head towards the very bottom of the Shaded Citadel. It's a massive problem. It's an annoyance. Yep. Yeah. Uh. Oh, this, this is just a non-starter. Being carrying... Oh, it's dead. <laughs> Oops. I guess I'll just eat it. We need light. So... I guess I'll just roam until I encounter a scavenger with a light. That's really the only way to go about it. I am trapped between 70 lizards, but it's okay. I speared one of them. Not sure where I ended up. Oh! Not sure if that spear throw actually hit 
my target? I don't think it did. Piece of scum. Okay, we have a... A spear and a rock. But I think this is a lizard. And I am hungry. Yeah, that's the lizard I killed. Alright, good, 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 good. Good old rock and spear is good enough. We don't need to make them explosive. I don't care about it. Basically just going forward until I find a scavenger. That's all I'm doing. Oh boy, did I find scavengers. Holy crap. <laughs> Idiot. Oh, there. I was not holding what I needed to hold. Wait, 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 wait. Like, they don't attack while inside pipes, but if I am in the pipe and they are not... Okay. If I am in the pipe and they are pipe and they are not, they can definitely attack into the pipe, can they? It's not tested. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that's the lizard I killed earlier. All right, never mind. Got myself the light. I that, This actually happened quite quickly. I cut, and like 10 seconds later, I... I came across a scavenger so now I'm going to save holy crap that was a spider what in the hell is happening here okay just an after image of, of the past I suppose or the present future and everything in between fantastic oh am I about to have a dream I'm about to have a dream aren't I one of them uh, gourmand style type of uh, little in between animation. Oh, is that an actual cutscene? Mind control? No. I am in control of the little baby. Oh, we. This is not going to end poorly at all. There's, you know, it's a reason. This lady is slightly vengeful, wrathful about the scavengers wonder what the scavengers did to these little babies oh i wonder mommy mommy feed me mommy 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 i'm going to, i'm on off my mother is not feeding me i'm just rolling out of this place this sucks i'm roaming out venturing out on my own okay that's actually nothing that's actually nothing i can do maybe just eat something no she's just letting the kids play Stupid cursor always interrupting. She's just dreaming of happier times. We're just watching over her beautiful kids as they played in whatever place that was. Fantastic, though. Loving it. Now I have a light and a safe game. And I am full. I am ready to eat. Full of delicious food right here. What a, what a fortuitous find for the egg bug to simply come inside the shelter all with me. With death itself. Death incarnate will not be stopped. Well, I don't know what the hell you just tried to do, but I am full of food. So, ready to go. Should I make this spear explosive? Probably. All right, now we just go down. Whatever I find transitions. You know what? Maybe explosives actually do damage against the spider creature. Whenever I find transitions, I go down. Whenever I find poils, poils, I go down. Oh, it's water already. This is the way. The only place with water is the place we need to go. I remember horrible plants always trying to murder me here, so coming with a little bit of care. Oh, I was like, did I just get killed? No, it's all good. Oh, that is worthless to me. This is trash. Unfortunately, I'm not the gourmand. Oh, my, my, my light. I left it behind. Oh, a little too excited. Please, plan, don't come out. It will be a very bad time to come out right now. Alright. Alright. 
we go forward, there's also places. This place always turns me around. It's like, are you supposed to transition through the place or are you supposed to... Oh, I remember. Okay, okay. So if we go forward from here... I really should have a spear. If we go forward from here... Is that a spear? No. Rock is not good enough. That's a spear. Yeah. Nice. Um, if we go east from here, that's the freaking plant. Got it. Whee! Maybe if I, ex I exploit through it, probably won't catch me. But I feel like that would be stupid. You know, to take that risk. This is already Memory Crypts territory. Holy crap, that was fast! Artificer. The greatest character ever created by Video Cult. I will right now become stunned in the water, though. Probably will just murder me. It is so satisfying to be able to just get past this nonsense. Die. Are you no, you don't die. I'm not the gourmand. I need to spear you several times. Time to eat, baby. And of course, I hear the other centipede, whatever the hell it is at. I don't know what's happening there, but we're definitely going to the shelter. Getting ourselves sells a safe game. Hell yeah. Oh! It was a rough beginning. That broken shelter really did me in. Also figuring out the mechanic of grabbing karma. Grabbing karma in the form of carrying around a corpse just brings me so much joy. And so, it's also, in theory, is going to be super satisfying to go through the memory crypts, being able to explode my way through the birdland. Wonder how tough it's going to be. I guess we're about to find out. This this uh, cycle is pretty trash. Pretty short cycle, but it's fine. We have butt explosions. Can I maybe use it inside ducts? I cannot. We have butt explosions. Woo! Express mode. I love it. <laughs> Alright, here we are in the memory crypts. And she's also so much faster than the survivor. Well, in she goes. Wish me luck. Basically, you're rolling dice when you come in here. Please. If you get caught out in the open, it's game over. But it's also, you know, maybe don't be too careless. He said while careening through the open air like an astronaut. Did you ever see a slug cat reach the top of this? Because I just... You just watched it happen. Wow. Pachow! Oh, that was not somewhere I could stand on, huh? Oh, oh. Get me out of here. <laughs> Holy crap. I need to do the transition. Okay, they're still enormously dangerous, obviously. We're not going to play some silly games. We're gonna play some silly games with this filth. But... You know, I don't feel as threatened by these monstrosities. Thanks to my incredible ability to just fly! Okay, that's the way down. Yeah, we'll, we go down. We go down this in this land. She also slides pretty far. Pretty far. That's an explosive spear, really? You know what? I've never, never used an explosive spear against the the birds. I have to kill one. I just now realized. I have to kill one. I am obligated. It's in the contract of the Artificer. They're extremely deadly, though. If I if I find one by himself, that was a the most elegant jump you ever saw. Come on, that was absolutely glorious. That was majestic. The way I dove 
into that spot. Woo! Can they reach me if I'm up here? I'm gonna be sad if I don't get the opportunity to have a one-on-one -on -one interaction with the birds. It's another beautiful way down. Amazing. All right, we can probably escape any assault by doing something like this. No, doing something like this. Oh, oh, oh. maybe not. <laughs> there you are. It's pretty awesome. Really love the all the options that the super jump introduces. If there's something more fun in video games than double jumping, <laughs> it just phased into existence. Just teleported into the screen. It gave me maybe a second to, to react. All right, I'm here again. And I would like to at least throw one of these explosive spears at the filth. Give me also this rock. This rock, yes. And we're going to make a grenade out of it. I would like to at least have them suffer a little bit. Damn it, I missed. <laughs> did it destroy my spear? It did not. I'm not the greatest spear thrower, I guess. I am fairly useless. Here comes another. Eat it! That did not work out. It really, like, their body is hard to even hit. Because they are all legs. And the spears go straight through the legs. So, just forget the entire aggression angle against these creatures. Just speed through it as fast as possible. Woo! Speed through it as fast as possible, and now I'll, I'll see you on the other side. May have been snatched out of the air by a super bird one more time. Run! Oh! <laughs> Jeez! Hardly any time to react. Holy crap. If I weren't able to explode my way out of the situation. Oh! What? Why do you even exist? Well, we're about to test out whether they can reach up here or not. I don't think they can. Why is there a freaking centipede in the passage? What am I supposed to do about that? And then blow it up, I guess. I suppose I'll just blow it up. I am down with that with that plan. Can I go above? Let me do that. Definitely could use some extra food though. Holy crap. Okay, okay, we made it through here. Don't centipede me though. A little bit of respite. I am a hungry gal. Be quiet. Time to eat. Time to go into my belly. You have become more fuel for my expedition. Hopefully you didn't call mama. I don't see anybody. I don't see any kind of monster. That was entirely violent and unnecessary. Okay. Uh, please. Can you, can you maybe get out? Yeah, yeah, that would be great. wonder if this is a consumable, I mean a collectible that only she can reach. They are slug cat specific, right? The um, collectibles that you find? Or are they always scattered no matter what in the map? I don't know, but either way, I am so glad to be here. Let's climb up the classic way. Don't need to be fancy about it. I know that my farts are extremely super deadly. Don't make me go find me a monkey. There's been no monkeys whatsoever. All right, it is a very violent gate. Fantastic. 
thing is, I am a hungry boy, though. So, unless there's some kind of... I guess we'll have to uh, make a meal out of a lizard. Oh, baby. Ten to five pebbles. This expedition is, this is the easiest uh, slug cat ever conceived. I'm already at five pebbles. Started a garbage waste. When have you ever gone so fast? It's only been an hour. Been trying... Been... Trying to make these play sessions a little bit longer. Depending on the time that I have during the day. I've been actually recording these after work. Something that is quite the rarity for me. I hate this. We need to find some meat, you see. We could have we could have just explored upwards, but let's just do it the old fashioned way. We need to find some lizard meat. Usually over here there will be fantastic lizard candidates. To fill my belly, because we need two more pips. There may be enough fruit actually to get it done, but why? Well we can Whoa! What is happening? There's some kind of something right here. Some kind of creature full of spines. Ah, I missed. Oh, this thing shoots horrible darts. Get me out of here. Oh, hey, it's just determined to get me, huh? We're just going to juke it a little bit. Oh! That was amazing. That was amazing. The way that he just bit me forever. It's not dead though. It's not dead. It's just plain to be dead. Did I have a spear in my hand? I did not. It's just plain dead. A piece of garbage. I mean, I did explode next to it. It's really not moving. Oh, give me the spear. I don't know exactly the mechanics of what just happened. I missed. It's dead. Don't ask me. I, I grabbed a spear somewhere. Because it had a spear lodged into its freaking face. So, you know. Don't look a gift spine monster in the mouth. Just be happy it happened. Go to shelter. And call it a day. And we are going to call it a day. I would like to record some more, but it's nearing my bedtime. And we're going to go visit Five Pebbles in the next episode, that's for sure. See what he has to say. Well, give me permanent light at the very least. And after that, whatever he wants me to do, I'll do. If he doesn't give me something to do, we'll go to visit Moon and see if she has something to do. But from this time forward, I bid you... Farewell until, until tomorrow. Tomorrow, I am all Rain World all in until this is done, motherfuckers.